Hello and welcome to the Red Men TV. My word, we have just played the Toffees at Anfield. And yeah, they haven't won here since 1999. That's absolutely battered them. Um, we were talking the build to the game. What could we do to give them that little sniff of hope to make them think like this might be the time they might finally break the hoodoo? Well, you know, we let them we let them get in. We conceded a, a, a genuinely terrible goal. They had that corner five minutes before. We got very lucky not to concede from it. They did it again. They scored, and they thought, and they, they, you could see them thinking, "Whoa." We're in this now, this is our year, this is our year. It's not your year, Everton. It's never going to be your year at Anfield. Unlucky. Um, the Reds were brilliant. Phil Coutinho, who's done absolutely shot all for weeks, uh, turned up and scored the goal that got us back into it. Sadio Mane, great. Divock Origi as well, coming off the bench. Difficult circumstances. Mane's injury you know, doesn't, doesn't look good. Doesn't look good, to be perfectly honest. But you're thinking, oh no, this could... Does this give Everton a lift? Does it give them impetus? No. Does it bollocks? Because they don't know how to get a lift. They don't know how to get impetus. This is Anfield. They come here and they poo their pants. Um, and Diva Carigi goes on and makes it 3-1. And, you know, I'll be perfectly honest. <clears throat> like I said, I'm disappointed we conceded the goal. But, you know, it could have been it could have been a lot more. Trent is very, very unlucky. It's a very good save from Rob Lester, keeping from this weird Stevie-esque chip lob thing. Um, we were, we were magnificent. Lucas Leiva, can I just say, I, again, I, I've been doing this for 10 years with Lucas Leiva now, and be, I don't know what, what people, what, whether it, it's not coming across on the telly, and if you watch this going, Lucas didn't have, Lucas was magnificent today. He absolutely bossed that midfield. He come up against Barkley and Davies, and these two local lads, local lads, let me remind you. I get, you know, we're a team that had not, no local lads in there. They're trying to get as many in as possible. Try and create a bit of bite, a bit of venom, a bit of like a bit of aggression, a bit of positivity. And Lucas Slaver basically just picked them up, smacked them about the face, put chucked them in his arse pockets, and carried on playing football like an absolute god. Now he was he was he was great. Genie Wan Nardum was great. Emre Chan, there's another guy coming for loads of criticism this year. He was brilliant again today as well. Firmino led the line excellently. Again, Mane wanted to see him do more throughout the consistently throughout the game in this one. And he did, as I say, big uh, big disappointment to lose him, but Liverpool were just great. What an occasion, what a day. The sun is shining above Anfield. It started pissing down rain, and Liverpool's performance have blown those rain clouds away, blown away any hopes uh, that Evertonians had, any doubts that we might have had that they could have got something from this game. And we kick on for the rest of the season. Boss. That's how we should spend all our, that's how we spend all our Saturday afternoons. It's just putting the blue shite in the place. Amazing. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed the game. Subscribe to Red Men TV. And if you want to see more of me, I've got my own channel now. It's Boss. It's not got many subscribers, though. Make it happen. Click my face. Go over there. Subscribe. Ta-da.